Hi, I'm Richard Byrne. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use Microsoft's new designer tool to quickly create a variety of different designs from your pictures and words. Let's go ahead and take a look at how this works. So I'm signed in at designer.microsoft.com and I've already chosen the new design option and I simply have to write what I want the design to be about. And so I might write something like a Facebook post about my new class on teaching history with technology. And then I simply have to add a photograph or let Microsoft Designer generate an image for me by simply writing out what I would like it to be. But in this case, I have a picture I want to use and I'm going to use this picture. And you can see there, I can add another image if I want and select from my device and add in another picture. And now it will generate more designs for me. And when it's done, I can pick from any of these designs. You can see here I have some designs to look through. And let's say I want to click on this one or this one here. Or if I don't like it, let's say I want to trash that one and I'll go back here. And now I can look at all of those designs. And let's say I like this one. Let's customize it though, where it says join my new class, learn history with technology. I want it to say not learn history with technology, but I want it to say teach history with technology. So I'm going to go ahead and override the learn and put in teach history with technology. So I'm still using the same basic framework that it generated for me but I've now changed out the words. And you can see because I changed out the words, it created some new design options over here on the right hand side that I can now pick from. And maybe I like that one a little bit better, or perhaps I like this one here even more. And if I like that one, well, I'll go ahead and download it. We'll see right there, teach history with technology. And I'm now, going to download that and we'll see this one here is an animated one so it's going to suggest that I download it as an mp4 but I could also download it as a png if I want to and I can say remove the watermark and now let's download that image as a Facebook post that I can use. So that's a short overview of Microsoft's new designer tool You'll find it at designer.microsoft.com. It's a nice, easy way to get a whole bunch of different designs all at once. As always, for more things like this, please visit practicaledtech.com or subscribe to my YouTube channel.